you're, and you, you'll be able to have a lot of the robot parts are cosmetic. You'll be able to switch out the kind of snap on cosmetic parts of the robot, make it look like, like something else if you'd like. Mm -hmm. It's fascinating that Elon Musk recently revealed that Tesla Optimus Gen 3 may have a gender when equipped with customizable parts, something similar to what happened with the Cybertruck and its aftermarket accessory kits. Combined with customizable voice features, this promises to turn the Tesla Optimus into a true nurse for everyone's peaceful life. How will this happen? How will the Tesla bot defeat all of its Chinese robot competitors? That's what we'll dive into in today's episode. And welcome to Techno Creators. Before we begin, please help us reach 5,000 subscribers. It will be a huge motivation for us to continue bringing you great tech episodes. Moreover, you can ring that bell to get the latest notification about the next episode. We will try to get rid of AI-generated videos and voices if we get support from all of you guys. In a podcast conversation with the U.S. Senator Ted Cruz, when asked about AI and robots, Elon Musk bluntly revealed his plan to completely change the way we perceive the Tesla bot Optimus. Could your future colleague be an autonomous robot, assisting you in completing tasks in a hospital environment? Tesla's humanoid robot demonstrates the capability to operate in dynamic environments and can also perform tasks and interact. These advancements in AI may potentially come at a cost lower than that of a conventional car. Perhaps Elon has just offered a solution to the global nursing shortage. Imagine waking up on your 91st birthday with a friendly robot companion bringing you morning coffee and a warm robe to start your day. After preparing your breakfast, it wishes you a good day and returns to its charging station for a quick recharge. Aftermarket accessory kits for the Tesla Optimus can be customized based on customer needs, or more precisely, you can customize the robot's gender or even transform it into an entirely new robot. Tesla is already selling a full range of aftermarket accessories for its five popular electric vehicle models, so it wouldn't be surprising if a similar lineup for the Tesla Optimus becomes available shortly after its market release. Additionally, Optimus's voice can be changed. At the We Robot event, we witnessed how this robot interacted with people. There were debates suggesting it was remotely controlled and that the voice used was actually that of a Tesla employee via microphone. That might be partially true, as Tesla continues to recruit staff for virtual reality control roles. However, the revelation that the voice includes both male and female options opens up a new perspective on user-specific customization for the Tesla bot. The ability to change voices is not just a technical feature. It reflects Tesla's focus on creating a personalized experience for each user. With two voice options, male and female, Optimus can be tailored to suit individual preferences, communication needs, and even the emotional aspects of its owner. This is especially important in environments such as elderly care, child education, or psychological support. Moreover, Voice customization opens the door to developing diverse virtual personalities, giving users the sense of interacting with a lively, friendly being that adapts to different contexts. If Tesla continues integrating machine learning to refine how the robot speaks in each user's unique style and language, then Optimus won't just be a smart machine, it could become a true companion in the future. Beyond communication capabilities, Optimus is gradually becoming a valuable assistant in caregiving environments, especially in healthcare and elderly care. With increasingly intelligent AI systems and natural language processing, this robot can perform tasks such as reminding patients to take medication, assisting with mobility, monitoring health, and even offering conversation and emotional support. Notably, Tesla's new generation robotic hand has been enhanced with soft and precise gripping abilities, along with sensitive tactile feedback. This enables Optimus to handle delicate and safety critical tasks like wound care, feeding assistance, or even measuring blood pressure and checking body temperature. The combination of advanced artificial intelligence and flexible mechanical structure is bringing Optimus closer to the role of a real nurse. This not only helps reduce the burden on the increasingly overloaded healthcare system, but also opens up a vision of a world where technology and humans work together to care for 
and support one another in a compassionate and effective way. How would Tesla optimize the Optimus Gen 3? As we previously mentioned, Tesla is believed to have remotely operated Optimus using virtual reality headsets. While many people have criticized this, I see the issue from a very different perspective. Instead of worrying about whether Tesla can truly launch a fully autonomous robot by the end of 2025, I believe the company should fully embrace its remote control strategy. Optimus can be operated remotely by humans using advanced VR devices like the MetaQuest or Apple Vision, an ideal solution for at-home care of the elderly, injured, disabled, or people with special needs. While many sci-fi universes depict fully autonomous robots performing these tasks, we can't realistically reach that future without encountering significant safety challenges. Remote manipulation of the robot's arms, for instance, can be achieved entirely through motion controllers. The next generation of robots may utilize a hybrid AI operation model, where a human operator guides the robot and AI handles the actual task of controlling the legs and arms to move as we would expect from a bipedal being. Tesla has also stated that some tasks could be fully automated and routines can even be programmed in advance. Communication will take place through a secure platform with multiple layers of security to grant final access to the robot for remote users. And of course, there must be a giant red off button to ensure nothing goes wrong. All of this is still hypothetical, but it's entirely based on practical solutions that Tesla and most other manufacturers could realistically implement. Mark Zuckerberg and many others in the VR industry have said for years that VR is more than just games. While some of the focus has shifted toward broader entertainment or the next generation of social networking, I believe the most powerful form of human virtual interaction may be achieved through the combination of VR headsets, virtual worlds, and remotely controlled robots interacting in the real world. While this may sound too expensive for most households, Musk claims that Tesla could offer the Tesla bot for just over $1,000 per month through a rental service or at a purchase price of $20,000. Considering the long-term or end-of-life care can cost thousands of dollars per month, the idea of bringing a capable human assist robot into your home for the equivalent of just a few months at one of these facilities is starting to sound quite reasonable. Beyond the convenience of being able to summon medical staff or loved ones to your home at any time, remotely controlled robots could be a huge benefit to overworked healthcare professionals who often only have time to care for one or two patients remotely per day. Scheduling a four-hour shift and spending a full hour with each patient by quickly switching between robots means that staff can spend less time on exhausting travel and more time providing actual care. As I've learned from my own remote work experience, it also means they can spend more time at home and with their loved ones instead of wasting hours on the highway or in an office. This could completely challenge the stereotype that Tesla Optimus will steal your jobs. Instead, it could enable people to work from home right alongside the family members they care about. How important is XAI's mission to Tesla Optimus? XAI states that its mission is to empower as many users as possible with intelligent tools to accelerate learning and innovation. The capabilities of Grok 3 may soon extend beyond software, with XAI potentially integrating the model into physical systems like Tesla Optimus for both industrial and domestic tasks. In fact, Grok 3's reasoning skills and expanded context window could enable the robot to handle detailed instructions and adapt to environments such as education and healthcare, performing complex tasks autonomously. For example, Optimus could use Grok 3 to interpret technical repair instructions, troubleshoot mechanical issues, or optimize workflows at Tesla's manufacturing facilities. Moreover, image analysis capabilities could further enhance the robot's perception, allowing systems like Optimus to identify objects and navigate their surroundings with greater accuracy. With the upcoming release of the Grok 3 API in the coming weeks, foundational models and reasoning capabilities will be made available, along with deep search features, facilitating integration into robotic platforms in the near future. So this year, we, we hopefully will be able to make about 
um, 5,000 Optimus robots. Uh, we're technically, uh, we're aiming for enough parts to make 10,000, maybe 12,000. Um, but since it's a totally new product with totally new, you know, like everything is totally new, um, I'll, I'll say like we're succeeding if we get to half of the 10th. In a recent live stream, Elon Musk made some bold statements and shared a few ambitious predictions for his humanoid robot project. Now, we're not saying everything he says will happen 100%, because, well, it's Elon. But some things are definitely being set in motion. Tesla plans to produce at least 5,000 Optimus robots this year, although in true Elon fashion, he casually mentioned that the number could reach up to 12,000. So things are about to get interesting. The humanoid robot race is heating up. And after closely following Tesla Optimus and the company's progress for some time, it's clear that Tesla holds a significant cost advantage over its competitors. Elon Musk even claimed that Tesla could produce Optimus for just $10,000, which is insane. On the other hand, Figure AI is also one of the more reliable companies with a clear product development strategy. Their robots are being developed for use in factories and to perform tasks in place of humans, similar to Tesla Optimus. Back to Optimus production. As we mentioned earlier, Tesla isn't just building a product. They're pioneering an entirely new industry. This isn't like manufacturing a new phone or car. We're talking about a humanoid robot that requires absolute precision in every component, algorithm, and movement. Unlike with cars, Everything from the assembly line to the AI software is being built from scratch, not copied from other existing prototypes on the market. If you've seen one of Elon's posts on X, you might remember that he confirmed Tesla will offer Optimus, both for rent and for direct purchase. But rental will be the top priority. Why does he prioritize this? Instead of a one-time sale, leasing generates a steady and recurring income stream monthly, quarterly, or annually. This allows Tesla to better predict cash flow and plan long-term finances. Many customers may not want, or be able, to pay a large upfront sum to own a brand new product. Offering rentals at a lower cost makes the product more accessible and expands the potential customer base. In a market where consumers increasingly prefer the use-it-don't-own-it model, like cars, machinery, and tech equipment, Leasing becomes a key competitive advantage to avoid falling behind. That said, if you're someone who wants to personally own a Tesla bot, it likely won't be difficult, especially with a price under 20 grand. What makes the Tesla Optimus so different? While most robotics companies focus on building a smarter AI brain or optimizing the walking speed of their robots, they often overlook one crucial aspect, the hands. Human intelligence isn't just about thinking, it's about a doing. And what is our most powerful tool for shaping the world? Our hands. Every structure, every technology, every complex mechanism we use daily exists thanks to the dexterity and precision of human hands. Tesla understands this. That's why Optimus is designed not only to be intelligent, but also highly capable. Optimus could be the first robot to truly function like a human, bridging the gap between AI and real-world usefulness. This could be the game-changing advantage that sets Tesla's humanoid robot apart from the rest and brings us closer than ever to the future. Additionally, Musk stated that Optimus will be produced in limited quantities in 2025, with plans to deploy over 1,000 units within Tesla's own facilities and the potential for production for other companies starting in 2026. Optimus is being trained by the supercomputer Cortex, an AI training supercluster currently being set up on the Tesla headquarters campus in Austin, Texas, to enable what they call real-world AI. Cortex will work on Tesla's full self-driving system, as well as the autonomous humanoid system for the Optimus robot. The latter will be used in Tesla's own manufacturing processes. Once completed, Cortex will connect 70,000 GPUs. In its initial phase, 50,000 NVIDIA H100 chips will be installed, with an additional 20,000 chips developed in-house by Tesla to follow. 
Tesla's vision-only approach is the main reason the company needs a supercomputer. The neural networks behind full self-driving are trained on massive amounts of driving data to recognize and classify objects around the vehicle and then make driving decisions. This means that when FSD is activated, the neural networks must continuously gather and process visual data at a speed comparable to the human ability to perceive depth and velocity. In other words, Tesla aims to create a digital replica of the human brain's visual cortex and cognitive functions. This is what makes Optimus truly stand out in the market. What do you think about this? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. We hope to bring the best information to you. Please give a thumbs up if you like this. Join Techno Creator by subscribing and hit the bell icon so you will not miss out on any awesome videos. We value your feedback. Thanks for watching. Until then, stay safe and have fun.